Match of the day 2 referred to Newcastle as scum as the subtitles wrongly translated Guy Mowbray's words. The BBC fell foul of a huge error while the highlights of Tootin's 1-1 draw against Liverpool were shown. 5 The subtitles did not repeat the words of Guy Mowbray. Getty, contributor 5 The commentary on Liverpool striker Sturridge were lost in translation. Mowbray said. Sturridge has scored in all four of his previous Premier League starts at Newcastle. For the Reds against the team in black and white, he boasts five goals in five appearances. However, an eagle-eyed viewer noticed that this was not correctly translated in the subtitles. Instead, it read, and for the Reds against the black and white scum he boasts five goals. The subtitles, which are often generated by computers using voice recognition, caused quite a stir with Toon fans. Following the error, a BBC spokesperson said, Our live subtitling service is normally very accurate and makes our content much more accessible, but there are times when unfortunate errors occur. On this occasion the error was spotted and corrected immediately. Rafael Bennett's side went on to frustrate his former club thanks to a fluke goal from Jose Lu. Getty Images, Getty 5 Jose Lu scored to snatch a lucky point for the tune. Daniel Jones, The Sun 5 Malbray's commentary was misinterpreted by computer software. Philippe Cutneau put the Reds ahead just before the half-hour mark with a stunning 25-yard strike, before the Spanish striker found the equaliser seven minutes later. This is not the first complaint that Newcastle fans have voiced regarding their media coverage in recent weeks. In August, Match of the Day pundits debated whether or not Toon winger Matt Ritchie should have received a red card for his tackle on Swansea Southie Mawson. However, the program did not replay a similar challenge that left Chancel Beam bleeding. Getty Images, Getty 5 cut no netted the opener for Liverpool. The summer transfer window was one of the craziest we have ever seen. Take a look at the most profitable transfers of all time. And here are the Premier League players whose wages made them the most expensive per minute played. Yo.